Everybody, Tim and Julie here for today's episode of Gotham Season 2, Episode 9, A Bitter Pill to Swallow. So, first of all, Michelle Gomez. I love Michelle Gomez. I uh, did not know she was in this show. I don't even know if they gave her character a name. She was just the random woman, mm, yeah. an assassin woman. Uh, but she's, like, from Doctor Who and Sabrina the Teenage Witch, stuff like that. So, super happy to see her. We also see the Flamingo who I briefly know from the comics. He was introduced right about the time I was actually getting out of comics. Uh, in fact, if I'd been smarter, I would have had the comic ready. He's very heavily based off of Prince in the comics. Especially like the Purple Rain, like with the motorcycle and everything. That's like his introduction cover. So we see that. And then the Riddler and the Penguin kind of teaming up, slowly becoming better and better friends. Uh, so... What did you think of the whole Captain Barnes getting shot by the assassins? What did you think of the flamingo? Although, in the comics, I don't remember him being a cannibal. I could be wrong, but I don't remember that. Uh, what do you think of him? What did you think of the Riddler and the Penguin? What would you think? Yeah, we said, said stuff was going to come down. Um, and Galavan mm -hmm. being in prison now. Yeah, and he's not liking that. And, um, yeah, it's, you know, you see, you see Gordon just get the shit beat out of him, and when Lee goes and cleans him up, it looks like nothing happened, nothing happened you know. TV magic. TV magic, yeah, bull crap. He gets <laughs> the shit beat out of him. Um, yeah. <laughs> And, um, yeah, and then the captain getting, getting shot while they were up in mm. Galavan's Which apartment. I know almost nothing about biology, but, like, him getting shot mm. in the leg, but, like, if you move, you're going to die because it's the, it hit the artery. 45 minutes later, he's just still sitting he's in the same position. Yeah, but I was like, to be here shortly. So. Is, is that how blood works? <laughs> I don't know. As long as you don't move, it stays inside your body? I don't know. I don't know. I you learn something new every day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, um, and then when they brought Flamingo into the police headquarters, and he turned around and stabbed the lady cop. Oh, oh, he like bit her. He like uh, ripped out her throat. throat. Yeah, yeah, he bit, yeah. like ripped out her throat. And, yeah, that was sad. I mean, another officer bites the dust. You know? I, I was sad. Yeah. I was more shocked than anything. But at the same time, like, I had no idea who that woman was. Like, it was just a nameless cop character. Mm -hmm. So, I was like, okay. Yeah. I mean, we could have seen her in other episodes. Well, because he saw her up there in Galvan's apartment mm -hmm. and and I think it was, was it, it wasn't um, Gordon said something about that she's a little nervous or a little oh, scared yeah, 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 or yeah. something. And he was going to watch her. Well, Good job. Yeah, he got her killed. <laughs> you know, because you didn't beat him enough downstairs. <laughs> right. <laughs> but, yeah, it was okay. I mean... Penguin. I was gonna say, what do you think about the Riddler slowly being more evil? Yeah, he's turned more evil. Uh, uh, you know, he's, he's like helping Cobblepot. And so I just love how Cobblepot's just like, I don't care. Uh -huh. And Riddler's like, but I have a secret. I don't care. Yeah, I killing. killed someone. I don't care. I, you know, kill me now. Yeah, like he's just you know, like, just, I just want to no. die. I have no reason to live, you know, because his mom is gone. I did really like that scene where the Riddler's like, so you had one weakness and it sucks that your mom died, but you literally have no weakness now. I, I really did like that. And like Cobblepot being like, yeah, I got that. When, when you have somebody who has nothing to lose, like those are the people you should be scared of. Because mm -hmm. what are you going to do? Like right. they, you can't threaten them at all. So mm -hmm. I did like that. But yeah. Yeah, a lot of things came, you know. The, oh, when, when Alfred, oh, when 
Bruce came downstairs and in his jammer. Oh, you know, trying to sneak out. Trying to sneak out. And he told Alfred about what happened earlier and he apologized to him. And, mm -hmm. But he still, you know, and he accepted his apology and then they said something. Gordon, or uh, Alfred. <laughs> held up the keys oh why was the yeah. taxi why was there a taxi out i, I didn't get a taxi so, oh, what are you oh, talking about like, what are these keys mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. so but then bruce pulled back and said so he, he had still had his jamma bottoms on but you know mm. that could have been he could have had his clothes underneath and taken mm -hmm. but, yeah i do feel like the season's getting better now mm-hmm yeah, and, for someone who didn't like the, at the beginning, it took you a while to get into it. And it's still, like, it's definitely not my favorite, favorite. <laughs> but it's it's getting interesting, yeah. I'll, I'll say that. Yeah. Um, right. Anything else? No. no? All right. Again later. Yeah. So, for those who have seen it, go ahead and let us know what you guys think. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing, and we will see you guys next time for The Son of Gotham.